Hello, fellow diamond painting addicts, and welcome back to Diamond Painting Anonymous. I'm Daphne, and I'm here today to share with you my Etsy small shop haul. So uh, before I jump in, if you'll do me a couple of favors, hit that like button and smash that subscribe button, and hit that bell notification icon so that you can be informed of future uploads. Okay, so as you may or may not know, uh, I set some goals for myself at the beginning of the year, and one of the things that I wanted to do was try new to me companies. And long story short, I eventually decided that what I was going to do to finish up um, my 15 companies was to do an Etsy shop and just find some diamond painting related items from shops that I thought were cool and share them with you guys. So that's what I've done. Now I'm actually gonna more than meet my goal because I thought I needed seven stores. I only needed six, but that's okay. That means I have seven different short stores to show you things from, and I'm just gonna jump in. So I've got all kinds of little boxes and whatnot here, and I have various items. I don't really remember what's what. I just kind of kept track of things as they came in and then set them aside. So. Yeah, I'm just gonna dig in. So actually, let me move all of these out of the way and then I'll just grab one when I'm ready to open it. So some I ordered small things, some I ordered some bigger things, so we'll see. Let me see if I got everything out of there. I did. Okay, so what I ordered, this is from Carol's Creations. And what I ordered from Carol's Creations is a cover minder. Oh, Carol's Creations AZ. So look at this little cutie pie. It's just this cute little sunflower, the cover minder that goes on the back so that you can um, use it as a cover minder with your cover sheet or whatever you want to use it for. Uh, I use them actually more than holding my cover sheets. I use them because sometimes I use a magnetic uh, light board underneath like my bigger projects. I will just use these to kind of hold the canvas in place rather than trying to use like big bulldog clips or something. So I often use them for that. So I ordered this and let's see. Um... It was $9.75, and that includes shipping so uh, and tax, because, of course, you end up having to pay tax. So I will, as I go through, I will put links in the description below to all of these items so you can find their Etsy shops and all of their fun little things. So, so there's one of my stores. So there's that. And then let me see. What do I want to open next? We'll do this one. I like this teal color package. Okay, what's in here? Oh, another something small. Oh, yes. This is the one I was waiting on. It's kind of a big package, but what I got was this. You guys, look at this cute little cover minder. It's like this little um, gears. There's like a clock and then a gear on top of it. So Tiny Pufferfish is the name of uh, the store. And again, it just has these little magnets on them for a cover minder. And this one was $10 and 31 cents. And again, that includes shipping, tax, all that good stuff. So yeah, I just thought this one was super cute. I love steampunk and I just thought this one was super cute. So I got that one. Okay. So that was number two. Let me open one of these boxes and see what one of these boxes is. See if I can figure out how to get in here without completely destroying the box. Although I appreciate all the tape so that things don't get destroyed when they're in the mail. Because it seems like these days stuff can be pretty hit or miss. Okay. So what have we got here? Oh, it's another cover minder. So it came in this cute little bag, this cute little fall pumpkin-y kind of bag. Let me put it down here on the white so you can kind of see it. And, ooh, I got one cover minder and a bonus. So this is the one that I ordered. This little looks like um, 
lollipop. I just thought those were super cute. So, and it's one of those, it's made out of like um, that polymer clay. And then, or maybe it's resin, I don't know. It feels like clay though. Maybe it's resin, I don't know. Anyway, Happy Hippo Finds. And then there's a bonus pumpkin one. So cool, two for the price of one. This one was $10, no, that was Tiny Puffer Fish. This one was $9.77. And like I said, I only ordered this one, so this was a bonus one, so cool. Two bonus or a bonus one. Okay, let me stick that back in there. Put it over there, let's see. And I have two bags and two boxes. What do I wanna do next? I'm gonna do this bag. Let's see what's in this bag. You guys, I'm so excited. I haven't bought anything for myself in so long. It was kind of crazy. Okay. Oh, yes. This one, you guys. It's washi tape, but look. It's a unicorn hula hoop thing. So there's a unicorn with the hula hoop on like a skateboard. There's like a unicorn mermaid little thing. And this is by Robot Dance Battle. So I thought this was super cute. And here's their little card. So they're on Instagram and they've got a website. So, and again, I will link in the description below to all their Etsy shops. Oh, and this one was $9 and four cents. I don't know if it says how much 15 millimeters wide and there's 10 meters of tape. So there should be a good amount of tape on there. So there's that one. Okay, I opened a bag last time, so let me open a box this time. Well, I guess technically it's a bag, but it feels like there's a box inside the bag. I've never seen one with this like cheetah print on it before. That's kind of funny. Okay, so let me set that one over there. Oh, no tape on this box though. Okay. Okay, little, ooh, stickers. Just a little thank you note. What does this say? Shh. And the crystal ball tells all. Okay, let's see what's in here. This is so cute. This is a little thank you button. What all is in here? Okay, let me, let me, let me get rid of some of this before whoop, the stuff falls everywhere. Okay, let me get, let me get rid of the I don't even know what you call that packaging, packing, like little raffia, whatever. Okay, blow pop, another blow, a mini blow pop, Jolly Ranchers Chewy, bubble gum and a sour bubble. I will not eat these, but my children will be so happy. Okay, so let me fold that back up. Oops, there's some more raffia. Is that the word I was looking for? It's not really raffia though. Oh, and I just jumped it, dropped it everywhere. Okay, so let, let me just pretend I didn't drop it. And ta-da, look at this. How cute is this? It's like this little unicorn sparkly resin tray. I actually can't wait to try this out and see how it works. So it's so pretty though, even if I don't actually use it for drills, because I don't know how well... I don't know how well it works for me. It's about the same size as the regular ones you get. But I just thought it was really pretty. I love the, the silvery glitter with the blue and purple and pink. And I think it was called a unicorn tray. Let me look at the paperwork here and see what it says. Yeah, unicorn dust drill tray. And this one was $24.96. Uh, and... Again, that includes shipping and all of that, but I just thought it was super pretty. Like I said, even if I don't use it for drills, I'll use it for like display because I just think it's so super pretty. Okay, so there's that one. And then I've got two more. Oh, let me put all that candy back in with that one so I know that's where it came from. Okay, so now do I wanna open the other box or the bag? I'm gonna open this bag first. Oh, and I need to put those stickers in the, let me put all this back in here with this so I know that's where it came from. Okay, 
And what's in here? Ooh, there's lots of stuff. Okay, hang on. This is a piece of paper. Okay, there's the bag. Okay. Yes, so I ordered two items from this. Oh, look, and I got uh, some little freebie stuff. So I got a little, like, clear crystal cover minder and a teeny, a skinny roll of washi tape with little flowers on it. Okay, so that's cute. And then what I ordered was release papers from Crafts with Crashly. And I ordered some Halloween ones because I thought they would be cute. So, and I think it's a set of 10. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Yeah, a set of 10. So these are just cute little release papers that I can use. I'm actually going to use them on my... Um, drills and chills canvas so I thought that one was cute with the little Halloween and then this one is just like a little geometric design and I just thought it was cute um, you know just as a kind of generic when I want to use it on projects something instead of just plain white which is what I have now uh, yeah so there's that okay and then is this like a what's in here Oh, there's some small little ones in here that are samples with her logo, Crafts with Crashly. And these are, she sells two sizes, so I, this must be the smaller size. I wanted the larger one because that's usually what I use when I'm diamond painting. But, so she included a couple samples of the smaller one. That's cool. Okay, and there's a little card here. Let me read that. Oh, and did I tell you how much it was? Uh, my total from her with everything was $15.46. And again, that includes tax and uh, shipping and all of that. So, okay. So, uh, she's got a card. Oh, and then there's some stickers in here. Look at this, Halloween stickers. There's a little pumpkin, a ghost. There's a little weird hand with bones flower, Grand Canyon, and then apparently she also has a YouTube channel, so I will have to check that out. Okay, cool. So let me put that one away. All right, there's one left, you guys, and then I'll, I'll pull all these back out. Okay, this is another, another box. I got to cut the tape which again, I appreciate so that it doesn't come open. Just takes me a minute to, to get into it. Okay. And this one, woo, that was a little paper on chalkboard. All right, let me, ooh, well, look at how nicely that's wrapped. There's a little card in here. Let me check this out. A little thank you card. Oh, how cute, a little kitten sticker. So there's that, and let me unwrap this. This is kind of weird paper. I've never seen this before. Interesting, but it spreads out. You guys, what is this? Someone enlighten me. What kind of magic voodoo is this? It's all stretchy. Cool. Okay, so the name of this place is Cat Proof Diamond Trays. I don't have a cat, so I don't need to worry about that, but I thought it was cool. It comes with this little plastic lid and it's got like a little paw print here and it's this little square tray. It's got pretty high size, which I like because I'm lazy. I don't like to dump just a little bit amount of drills. I dump usually a lot. So when I'm straightening my drills, having something to stack up here at the bottom is always nice. And it's got a little spout there for pouring. So, and it's a bit bigger. My other ones that have lids, I think I only have one that's, it's probably a little bit bigger than this, but my other ones are all very small. Well, I shouldn't say very small, but they're probably about half the size of this one. So, and cool that it's like this plastic lid that just kind of fits down nicely. Is this 3D printed? Like, I feel like it is because of the texture of it and everything. But like it's flexible. I didn't even know you could 3D print flexible stuff like this. See you guys, I learn something new every day. 
it is it does look like it's 3D printed. It had like a filament sticking off of there. That's cool. I'm going to have to have my husband look into that. We have a 3D printer, but I've never seen like filament that would be flexible like that. So that's super cool. And, oh, did I tell you how much this one was? This was $11.80. And I got the pink because I like to have my trays be a light color so that I can see all of my drills. I feel like when I'm doing the dark colors, like if I have a purple tray, but when I use it, I feel like if I'm doing a dark color of drill, like if I'm doing a black or a dark blue, I can't see the drills against the tray. So I just prefer to have the lighter colors. Okay, and I'm fascinated with whatever this is. I know it's probably some new newfangled kind of storage um, packaging thing that I've not seen, but anyway. So there is the end of all of my stuff. They have, I have the cat proof diamond tray. I got the uh, unicorn glow dust tray, I think was the name of it. So this is actually the name of their store is cat proof diamond trays. This is uh, I think the name of this is KNS Custom DP Pens, but they also sell trays, so they're branching out. And then I got the washi tape from Robot Dance Battle. I got the um, release papers from Crafts with Crashly, along with the cute little cover minder. I got these cover minders. Tiny Puffer Fish, Carol's Creations, and then Happy Hippo Finds. So is that everyone? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, there's my seven stores. Okay, so you guys, I'm excited. I'm excited to try all these out. I'm excited to try all the cover minders. I'm excited to try the trays. I'm excited to try the release papers. I'm gonna find something cool to use with my unicorn washi tape. So yeah, so, if any of the stores are something that you recommended, thank you. Because I think, I think at the very least, the robot dance battle, somebody recommended to me on Facebook. So thanks for letting me know. Super cute. They had a lot of like kawaii type stuff, which I love. So thanks for pointing them, uh, pointing me in their direction. And yeah, like I said, I will put links in the description box down below so that you can go visit all of these lovely people's Etsy shop and check out all of their stuff for yourself. Before you leave, guys, don't forget to do all the things. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And hit that bell notification icon so that you can be informed of future uploads. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching.